is ready to access the first tranche of the two billion Sino Hydro infrastructure for bauxite facility. As you would recall, the master project support agreement between the government of Ghana and Sino Hydro of China was entered into last year and subsequently approved by parliament. Now, after the initial hurdles were successfully managed, Ghana is now ready to tap into the first tranche of the agreement, which is worth about 649 million US dollars. Two sets of contracts have to this effect been laid before parliament. The first is what we call the engineering procurement and construction contracts, or the technical designs, uh, or the EPC contracts. The second is what we call the deferred payment agreements for um, this first set of contracts. Parliament's Finance Committee is scheduled to meet on the agreements at 2 p.m. today, after which meeting the committee's report will be presented to the plenary, hopefully before the end of this month, to pave way for construction work to begin. This morning, I'm providing you with a list of the projects that fall into the first tranche. About 84 kilometers of Accra inner city roads, and that includes the Gan North Trubu roads. In the Gan Central, we have the Anyasu Tum stretch. In the Gan East area, we have the Dome Kwabenya stretch. We have the Lejukuku Teshi road, and then we have the Nanakrong Santio road as well. That totals about 84 kilometers in Accra alone. We also have the Kumasi inner city roads, about 100 um, kilometers in all. There's the Menshia submetro, the Suami submetro, the Tafu Pankrono submetro, Asokwa submetro, Kwadaso submetro, Ofurikrum submetro, Subin submetro, Inshaeso submetro, Bantama submetro, and Asante Mampo. Totals about 100 kilometers of inner city roads um, in Kumasi. There's also the Tamale Interchange Project, which is part of this first tranche. There's the PTC Roundabout Interchange in Takrade, which is part of this first tranche. There's the Adenta Dodua Dual Carriageway, which is part of this first tranche, about 14 kilometers. The Sunyai Inner City Roads um, as well. There is also the upgrading of selected feeder roads in Ashanti and Western regions. Then there's the rehabilitation of the Oda Ofuase Abrim Road. That's where I come from, so we are also very excited about that. And then there's a the construction of the Hohoi Jasikan Dodo Pepesu Road. That's about 66 kilometers. Um, so these are some of the roads that you'll find in the first tranche of this transaction. Uh, when I say the Western Region and Cape Coast inner city roads, for example, the specifics are the Akotoche roads in Cape Coast, the Amamuma area roads in Cape Coast, the Abra New Community area roads in Cape Coast, the Polytechnic area roads, mm -hmm. the Apuska road and the links, and then in the Western Region proper, the Pristia town roads um, as well. 